are you are you coming to the model rooms hello everybody today's new day new opportunity for you for me right now it is uh, 701 of uh, today cs 20th september and i'm continuing my journey of learning english i'm a russian man who learns english through comedy with uh, bill burr bert kreischer with uh, george carlin freddie murphy and different Dave Chappelle tools. Yes, uh, today we're gonna watch one really interesting video about uh, model rooms and first ladies. Let's uh, jump into it. Let's do this together. Yeah, we can. All right, thank you. Thank you very much. How are you? How are you? Please be seated. Good evening. Thank you. Welcome. Welcome yeah, good to evening. this lovely theater here in downtown Montreal. Um, it's unbelievable. Can't understand you. <laughs> Female voice does not travel well. I don't know what it is. Up close or in a whisper can make you dick hard, but beyond 10 feet it just sounds like a couple of birds, fly, you know, <laughs> fighting over a french fry or something, you know? <laughs> girl's, girl's voice isn't good for traveling. There you go. I understood. That's how we start. Nobody's coming out of the gate. I'm, uh, I'm sick of Obama's wife. Yeah. Is she black? He's running her, this isn't some Democrat Republican shit. This is just in general. Just running her yap. It's just like, shut up. You know? You weren't elected. You know, your husband isn't running a lemonade stand. He's running the country. No, generally speaking, first ladies, they've been out of line for a good 25, 30 years. They think for some reason that their husband has the job, that now they should be chiming in like they know some shit. You know? It reminds me one video from uh, Bill Burr about the hardest job for women. Because, like, motherhood is the hardest job for, for women. Because if a uh, husband has a job, it means that girl can do everything. Okay, let's continue watching. Dude, if you had a leak at your house and you called the plumber, and the plumber comes in and he starts fixing it, what would you do if five seconds later his wife, who isn't a plumber, comes walking in, well, I think we should run it over here. It's like, shut up! Just because you're fucking the plumber doesn't mean you understand plumbing. Plumbing, what is it? I know plump, we have, in Russian language, we have the word plomba. Plomba we have inside of our here. Maybe plump, in uh, this case, it is something, it is crane, maybe. Maybe it is a special tool, like with a tube. And plump, it means something inside of it, maybe. But okay, it is a special tool from bathroom. Okay. No, this is all like my fears, because they're trying to tell us down uh, south here that like, they're starting to like gear up for Hillary Clinton to be running for president, saying like, I think that would be a good thing. Yeah, people clapping. What, what is that based on? Based on what? I don't get how she became a senator. That's shocking to you? She went from never holding political office to immediately being a senator. Why, because she was fucking the president? Should Tom Brady's wife be the next quarterback of the Rams? The quarterback, is it a player of football or what? Quarterback, I, I heard this word from uh, Forrest Gump, maybe. I don't remember when, where I found it, but maybe from book about Forrest Gump. Does he have some sort of magical powers? Like you suck at sports? I couldn't throw it all, and then he fucked me, and I just picked up this ball, and I was just, I was just lacing it in there. It was incredible. <laughs> He's funny. Dude, it all started, it all started with Nancy Reagan. That's where it first went off the rails, you know? She came out with her little bird body, you know, just 
your big head. Just came walking out, say no to drugs, and if people off the heroin, say no to that. Mm, she just walked back. <laughs> Hillary had her stupid health care plan. Obama's wife's running a yap on 60 Minutes, you know? <laughs> I gotta give it up to the Bushes. They had their women in line. <laughs> I did. They had their women in line. I, I think that uh, this storytelling about celebrity woman no it is back of celebrity woman no it is uh, like a celebrity links celebrity ah. woman woman celebrity links means links like a child it means that it is like a parasite Parasite, do you know what is Parasite? Parasite in Russia, it is a special person who wants to to take something from somebody. It is... Uh, one moment, I will translate it for you, special. Maybe... Parasite. Parasite, in your language, yeah. It is a Parasite Celebrity. Yes, it is maybe supporting for husband, but it is like... Uh, this celebrity has fame because husband has celebrity and right now Bill Burr talking about it I think Barbara never said shit she smiled every once in a while she threw something in there George W's wife I don't even know her name <laughs> still was in office for eight years I don't even know her fucking name what's it like Beth or Paige or something like that he had her on lockdown going out there tonight, I'm giving a speech. And when I say something and they laugh, you're gonna nod. You're gonna smile and you're, you're gonna nod that head. <laughs> is this how it's gonna be? Really? Do you think like me saying this is somehow gonna affect? She's still gonna win. Listen, let me ask you this question. Do you think that a woman being president is gonna affect anything? Is it before uh, Donald Trump? Uh Donald Trump started to be president, yes? I watched one video about his talk about Donald Trump position. Do you? Oh, do On a show, late night show. Do you? What, what are they gonna do? What are they gonna do? What's she gonna, what the fuck is she gonna do? Do you know what the president makes? The president makes 400 grand a year. That's it. He's supposed to keep bankers in line that get like $100 million bonuses. I'll tell you, if you really want, nothing's gonna change, okay? Black, white, dick, or clam. It, it doesn't make a big... Clam, clam, what is it? It's a special tool for, for some sexual harassment time? One moment, need to translate it to this, uh, so, clam. Ah. Clam, it is from Mana movie. Clam. Or maybe... A, one moment. It is a dollar, a marine, bivalve well mollusk with shells or squill size. Dig for or collect clams. Okay, let's continue. Bit of difference. Nothing is going to change until somebody's got the balls to start a group, go over the wall of one of these gated communities, and you start you start slitting some throats. Slitting. Not just random. Th slitting means maybe that. Uh, they will do putting their dicks inside of their throats. Throats, the right throats. <laughs> you gotta climb up a tree, be up there with your scope, knowing that in 11 fucking minutes your life is gonna end, right? And take out many, many of those people as you can. <laughs> yeah. Other than that, it's just going to be a pair of tits saying the same shit to you. <laughs> I'm staying in a hotel, everybody. <laughs> I like staying in hotels. They make me feel comfortable. comfortable. I feel safe in a hotel. Comfortable. <laughs> nice. Hell, you know, you got the lobby. There's always somebody down there in case an axe murderer comes in. That's the first person that's going to get killed. You can hear their screaming when you're up in your room. Gives you a chance to plan. Barricade the door, you know, turn on the shower, hide in between the mattresses, right? 
little misdirection. Back in the day, I used to stay in, uh, I used to stay in motels. I hated staying in motels. Could never feel safe. You basically, you were lying in a bed two feet from a door that just opened up out into a parking lot. <laughs> Anybody in the world could just come walking up, kick the door open, ah, you motherfucker, just drag you out of the bed. What is motel, by the way? I always, I know what is inn, I know what is hotel, I know what is hostel, I know what is dormitory, I know what is apartments, I know what is house, but motel, motel, it is uh, maybe for auto, automobile, cars, for uh, motorcycles, but maybe it is uh, like a hostel, but so with open, with open, always opened rooms. Maybe yes. Okay. And you're just lying in that bed, so not ready to have a fight to the death. <laughs> Sitting there half naked, like nodding off. Da -da 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 -da. Meanwhile, there's some guy on the other side of the door with a chainsaw, like. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> chainsaw. Lying there, like, oh, it's kind of early to be trimming the hedges. <laughs> and when that dude comes through that door, you lie to yourself as a man that if something like that happened, dude, I'd just jump up, grab a lamp, let's fucking do this! <laughs> you know what the reality is? Most people, the best you could do is maybe make a weird noise. Just be like, <laughs> and that would be it. That would be it. That dude would just come in. <laughs> the last thing you'd see is just ceiling carpet, ceiling carpet, ceiling carpet, ceiling carpet, ceiling carpet. <laughs> Look at upside down back at your own body, right? <laughs> I will say this. What I do enjoy about this theater is nobody has told me it's haunted. Anytime you go into a theater, they always give you the history. It's built 1948. It was a tribute to Rocket Richard. Everybody chipped in, blah, 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 blah. And we have a ghost. His name is Michael. Michael? <laughs> I Michael. Here. A road on motorcycle. Dig bigger than a tower, especially of Eiffel. Immediately lose all respect for anybody over the age of eight that still believes in ghosts. It's like, really? You still believe in specters and goblins? Goblins. Elves. What is the end game of being a ghost? I don't get it. You can go anywhere you want to go in the world. You're just going to stay in a basement for the rest of your life? Just waiting for once every six months, somebody comes down to check the boiler, and you get to be like, Why would you go somewhere? How to do this? Yeah, no. I don't know how to do this. Uh, need to try to do this. It is like, more like a chicken. Dude, I'd fly right to Washington, D.C., fly right into the CIA building, just start sitting in on meetings, like, these guys are out of their fucking minds! <laughs> fly to the Super Bowl, go right into the huddle. I always wondered what they talked about. I'm not gonna spend the rest of my life in an attic <laughs> trying to scare some accountant into solving my murder. To solve my murder. Interesting, by the way. Interesting second part about models. Not super interesting first part, but it is not fault of uh, this man Bill Burr. It is maybe my fault because I didn't understand it fully. It is not my fault. <laughs> the fault in our stars, yes, and uh, I think that it was good uh, about models was interesting, about uh, this uh, so chain so, about else uh, how hound theaters from 1948 or maybe another things, about Obama's uh, and uh, different uh, people from from elevation, or how to say it, it is a special thing to provide president to a country. It is event to provide. One moment, I will translate it. It is elections. Elections. Election. Erections. Election erections. Uh, and uh, about it, it was not super interesting, in my opinion. Because uh, 
I didn't understand. Maybe I have not this. I don't have this culture. I just I understood what uh, he was saying about, but I didn't understand the joke. It is my opinion. But about hosts, it's for everybody. About uh, models, it's for everybody. And even I didn't know, and about models. Models need to Google, by the way. What is model? What is it? Look at this. Model accommodation type, uh, hotel building function, model, it is small, ah, I know, it is like a from uh, pulp friction, from pulp friction type of, type of hotel, it is, uh, yes, I understood, hotel, it is so, so securitive, security uh, but here you have insecurities inside of uh, motel because uh, you have door near your uh, i was living in uh, by the way i i was in sochi on 2016 and i was on uh, motel too i was living it was on the streets uh, it is <laughs> it was funny by the way door was so plastic and uh, easy to crash and if somebody will try to do even punch or sorry kick off of this food you will have new guests inside of it thanks so much for watching i hope you enjoyed if you enjoyed please write in the comment section and recommend more your videos to speak about to react on that and it uh, and uh, you know that all depends on your life only on you and my life depends only on me and the more i will practice the more the biggest the bigger the bigger qualities of english i will have i know about it right now we're practicing listening skills and comprehension skills hmm? yes thanks bye bye